celebration be without a Caesar, the birthplace of birthplace the Caesar. Of Caesar yeah. And uh, now tell me a little bit about the background, Daniel, and who came up with the uh, idea of the Caesar. The gentleman's name was Walter Chell. Mm -hmm. um, back in 1969, he was tasked to create a cocktail feature for our new Italian restaurant here at what was called the Calgary Inn, now the Western Calgary. Right. Um, a lot of the foods were going to be pasta dishes with seafood, so they wanted a cocktail that had that kind of uh, seafood, I guess you could say, quality to it right. that would pair up well with those dishes. And along came the Caesar, uh, a mix of clam juice, tomato juice, Worcestershire, um, and then your famous garnishes. Okay. And, yeah. Fantastic. 1969 was the year. Yeah. Y there's an ingredient missing. There is one missing on the table because there's a bit of a misnomer that the Caesar comes with Tabasco sauce. It does not. It's actually just made with a little heavy dose of Lee and Perrins or yeah. whatever Worcestershire you'd like. Um, Tabasco came along, it's kind of an easy way to season it, but most likely it was garnished with garlic powder, onion powder, chili flakes, but there's no Tabasco in a Weston Calgary season. Is that right? Yeah, it's made without huh. it, so. Learning new things here this morning. Okay, we're gonna yeah. make a traditional Caesar, yeah. the original recipe. From scratch with from clam scratch. juice, which because the Caesar's so popular mm -hmm. everywhere in Canada, you can literally get clam juice at any supermarket now. Okay. It's everywhere because people like to leave out the MSG, the gluten's very popular, gluten free is right. very popular right now. So you can make your own. And if you ever want and you're having a cocktail party, you could always steam some clam shells and use that broth as clamato, ju uh, clamato juice. Get, get yeah. really fancy. Okay, okay what are the perfect. proportions we're okay, working two with? Two to here? one. Two to one. So two parts tomato juice. And I pour this uh, over ice. You're going to pour it actually in here first. Okay, you pour you all got your it. ingredients separate before the ice. You don't want your ice to melt too soon. Okay. Right. Thank you. Thank you. And then we got your clam juice. All right. Okay. Oh, you got quite a bit in there. Oh, uh oh. There we go. That's all right. We'll be okay. And then you want to add some Worcestershire. Yeah. Worcestershire. For sure. And then shake that up. The secret ingredient we won't tell people on. On TV, a little vodka. Didn't see a thing. <laughs> Didn't see a thing. Okay, and now we just roll gently back and forth. So you roll that into here. So this is called rolling versus shaking, which... So if you shake your Caesar, see, look, we got lots of room. If you shake your Caesar, you get lots of bubbles. Right. Uh, so you'll see a lot of places they'll stir it, or they'll actually take a celery stick and just shake it down. It but then you actually don't get a lot of the ingredients that are on the top, like the vodka will just kind of float on the top. So you okay. got to kind of mix it around. Perfect. We've rolled that up. Yeah. Now we're going to strain this. Yeah. And we're just going to throw that right into the glass for an authentic. Different ice in the glass that is being served in. Yeah. You want to keep it nice and cold, but you don't want to use the melted ice or you're going to get a watered down Caesar. A little scratch of the pepper and a, a little, little garnish. Lime, little celery. Dun dun dun. -dun. Happy birthday, Weston Calgary. Thanks. 50 years. And there we have it. One for you, sir. Thank you. And one for me. Uh -huh. Cheers. Don't get hit Cheers. with the celery stock. <laughs> <laughs> we'll move that aside. <laughs> Looks good, right, Tark? Breakfast of Champions. More with Jill celebrating the Weston's 50th birthday. Still to come. And also still to come, health specialist Leah Sarich will be in talking about new hope for heart failure patients. We'll be right back. You're watching Breakfast Television on City. BT is brought to you in part by...